Live from the Carl Chevrolet Studios in West Des Moines, this is Iowa Live. Welcome back to the program, everyone. Well, the year 2022 has been a year unlike any we've seen in a long, long time. There has been hailstorm after a hailstorm, even as recent as this morning, Jared Harrison from R3 Roofing and Exteriors. And a lot of people have had damage over the past several months, and that's why Jared is here. Good to see you, man. Yeah, thanks for having us on. All right, tell us a little bit about R3. Uh, so R3 is just a local contractor. We've been working in the Des Moines market for over three years now. Uh, we've done almost a thousand projects in that time. So uh, we're, we're well equipped and uh, we're already well networked and getting referrals in the neighborhoods that were just hit this past Friday. Right now, uh, we were talking about uh, hailstorms that have been rolling through this year. And one of the things we want to stress here today is to be wary. Be wary of some of these signs that you see popping up all over the place that you've never heard of. Maybe these companies that, you know, might be uh, Tom and Bill's roofing company. You, you know, hopefully there's no Tom and Bill out there, but there's you want somebody who A, is local, and yeah. you want somebody who is experienced. Correct, yeah, so you're gonna want somebody that's got 20 to 30 Google reviews over the course of the last couple of years that shows that they're actively doing business in the market, and of course you're looking for four and five star reviews. Yeah, now, now why the, those Google reviews? Why are those so important? I mean, that's a customer's ability to go out and publicly basically shame a company into getting what they want done. Mm -hmm. um, so if you, if you see companies with a lot of negative re reviews and they're not resolved, that's a huge red flag. Yeah, because that happens when you, you get a negative review, the company will try to resolve that. If they're not willing to resolve it, that tells you a little bit something about the integrity of the company. Absolutely, yep. Yeah, and your reviews are outstanding. Well, thank you. Yeah, we like to try to stand behind <laughs> the warranties we offer. <laughs> yeah, and speaking of that, uh, something we want to let people know about, if you were involved in any of the storms uh, in the past uh, month or so, or even as recently as last Friday, or even this, this morning over west of Des Moines, yep. um, you guys are offering something that is really great where you're going to be able to check them out. Right, so we'll offer a free property inspection, not just looking at the roof, we wanna look at everything on the property to maximize the insurance claim. I mean, if you're gonna pay your deductible, you wanna get as much out of it as you can. Um, and then we agree to do what work we can with the homeowner, whether that be roof or siding or gutters, whatever. Yeah, let's take a look at some of the uh, the damage that has been done here uh, in Iowa uh, that you can see, maybe you didn't even think about this, maybe this is on the back side of your home and you didn't even see the damage on the siding. Yep. Uh, we see this kind of damage everywhere. People don't see it. It's on the roof. They can't see it. It's high up on the siding. They don't see that. Um, you need to have oh, somebody wow. get on the roof to take a look. I and mean, clearly you can see that, that one. That one, now you can see the sky, so you know something's wrong there. Yeah, correct. <laughs> but uh, a but lot look of, at this. This, yeah. this. this is no good, right? No, yeah. I mean, it doesn't seem like much, but that damage is kicked off, or that hail kicked off the granules on that shingle. It's now shortening the time span of the life of the shingle, and it needs to be replaced now. Uh, you can see those gutter guards are all smashed up. That's right there in West Des Moines. Yeah, and, and look at just some of the other equipment that is damaged, too. Yeah, and those circles there, those, those hits are two to three inches in size, and that's how big that hail was. Wow. Uh, that's dangerous stuff. Even uh, flat roofs. Yeah, flat roofs. We're seeing damages on all kinds of different flat roofs in the West Des Moines and Clive area from that storm. Wow, so you can go out and you can, look at the size of this one here. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing, but uh, no, in a situation like this, uh, you know, with the, the uh, service that you have and with the experience that you have, you are able to work with the insurers and they know that you know what you're talking about. Correct, yeah, we're a preferred contractor with most of the larger carriers. Uh, we're also master elite installers with GAF, which is one of the higher quality shingles that's still available right now this late in the year. Right. Now, uh, when people may have had some damage here recently, how quickly can you come out and do some assessment? We're scheduling inspections same day, if not within 24 hours. So if you were to pick up the phone and call now, you're gonna likely gonna get a call back today for scheduling the appointment. We could be there today, we could be there first thing in the morning. All right, let's take a look at uh, how to get a hold of R3 Roofing and Exteriors, uh, folks. Really simple, there is what the website looks like. Uh, r3roofs.com. Yes, sir. That, that's pretty simple. You don't need a big, long explanation there, do you? Nope, not at all. And actually, if you turn the three around and make it an E, it's re-roofs. <laughs> Even better. Uh, so we have that. Take advantage of this free inspection. If you have a question about it, you want them to come out and take a look at it. Jared, uh, thank you for being on, man. Appreciate Always it so much. Always taking care of our viewers and making sure that you are safe and your property is protected. As always, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Y'all take care of yourself. Enjoy the rest of the day. We'll see you back here tomorrow for Iowa Live.